Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of the new save file. We are jumping in again and I kind of want to get some more challenges done. I'm not exactly sure which ones to go for. I mean, when life gives you lemons for Card Against Humanity is pretty darn good. Um, super fan is also really, really good. They're just... It's difficult because they're not like super interesting watches, uh, some of these earlier challenges, but they are like particularly good unlocks on some of them. Um, Maggie's Pill. Ooh, April's Fool. Do you know what? Actually, no, no. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to play as the deleted because I, I wanted to do a challenge run and kind of deleted basically is challenge runs. We'll do a greedier deleted. How wacky could that be? Um... And um, someone expressed interest in wanting to see a deleted run recently uh, when I asked about what characters you want to see. And so I I want to do it more because, yeah, it's it's definitely an interesting one. Um, and I, I've never tried him on Greed Mode before. It could be interesting. Um, I don't know if there's any specific unlocks for deleted. I don't think there is. But still, I'll give this a good go regardless. And we will go as Happy 99 here. Um... Okay, so breakfast is definitely getting bit flipped. Um, use soul of Magdalene and get whatever the hell that is. We did get it. It's given us a little aura thing. It's gone away now. Okay. So, it's kind of an interesting one. Um, I think right off the bat we just bomb this. And I realise that rerolls everything. Oh, we got a golden penny. We might be able to buy an item right off the bat here. Um, now... An interesting thing that's just shown up, however, is the loaded dice. That that has played some interesting roles before. We did get enough. Let's have a look what everything looks like flipped. Um, that's not great. Every kill chance to get that um, on item spawn. Oh my god, that's bad. Each room, 25% chance on... Okay, that's not great either. Okay, so all of these are pretty trash. On use, re-rolls... Oh, it, we, we keep the negative though now on all of these. I kind of forgot about that. Um, I'm going to take this. And... I'm big as this on now. Each boss kill, use Anza, spawn three key, spawn a dump. Why not? Oh, that's what a dump is? Okay. Um, spawn a fat sack. I don't know what enemy a fat sack is. Um, so this is kind of not a great idea. Get three something wisps. It's not great, to be honest. We can't even afford it anyways. Wait, what? It was a noise. I'm unsure what that noise meant. Get out of here. Get out of here. Double kill. Okay. Something's going on. I'm not sure what. See what we get out of this. Stitches is kind of worth just taking, to be honest. Stitches is really good. Um, I think I'm just going to take Stitches. Stitches allows us to get into the cash rooms for free. Um, and a bunch of other stuff as well. Not great. Potentially great. Spicy key is... Eh. Cursed batteries. This thing's going to blow up at any second, so I'm going to have to be ready for that. Ooh, hello. That's actually a really good trinket. Um, Yeah, really good trinket. Right. Out we go. Okay. Right, let's let's give this a go. So we, we do have the ability to um, double kill, triple kill. Oh, my lord. Quad kill. Penta kill. Sex double kill. Haha, <laughs> funny word. Oh, my god. Octo kill. Well, whatever this item is, it's very, very good for us. I don't know what item this is or what it's from, but it seems that we just get scaling damage depending on how many kills we've had, which, of course, is absolutely absurd in greed mode. Um, unfortunately, there is a timed limit there, by the looks of it, on uh, how long you've got between each kill before it dissipates, but the time seems reasonably generous, and of course, considering the damage keeps scaling up, it's reasonable to uh, keep it going. We're not going to be able to keep it for bosses, but for killing waves, it's pretty darn good. 
pretty darn good indeed. Ow, bad hit. Just try and get a bit of damage for this. Yeah, I got, I got a little bit there. I'll try to get a little bit of extra damage on the boss. I've got to make sure to be in a place where I can escape that guy. Oh, we got Onzus for uh, killing a boss there, which is reasonably good for finding secret rooms, I guess. Okay, this is not great. Managed to take you out. I'm not a big fan of the little little baby goober we've got flying around the place right now. I'm trying to telefrag him, but it's not really working. Getting these extra coins is going to be super, super nice. I don't actually know if the teleporting damage is particularly worthwhile for us here, but I'm going to try it out. This guy dashes four times, right? Yes, he does. Yeah, it seems to be doing pretty well. The telefragging damage is good. There you go. Okay. Reasonably taken care of. I did not mean to start this next wave. That was a complete accident. Do not die on this run. Yeah, it was a complete accident, that was. I think bosses are guaranteed to drop one of those spoiled coins, you know, by the looks of it. I'm trying to get in my uh, telefrags whenever I can, because they're doing a considerable amount of damage. Didn't want this, but I guess it means we're going Angel Deal now. Um, we don't have any ability to reroll any of these. Um, yeah, I think we just leave them then. Which is kind of a waste, but yeah, what else do I do? Right. Let's a go go. Okay, next floor. So far, things are interesting. We've certainly got some spice. As for the question of the day today, I actually got Chatsy GPT up for this. I'm ready. What is one piece of advice you would give your younger self um, knowing what you know now? I think that's a pretty darn interesting one. Um... Oh, shit. Okay. I think we have like, a random chance to do stuff when we bit flip. It gets blank. Every 11 rooms use... Okay, first hit each room. Okay, that's terrible. Okay, I think on Bitflip we have a random chance to spawn a random enemy. That's straight up speed. It seems to be able to spawn some reasonably horrible enemies too. On bomb, use a snow globe. On hit, get tiny amounts of damage. Ugh, this is... These are some real bad rolls thus far. Why... What did we pick up that's giving us random enemies? I did not mean to start that wave. Bullshit you. Sorry, but I'm going to have to end this. I don't have the health to actually do this. I did not mean to start that. Right. What we got going on here? I think... Binky and Odd Mushroom are two things we could... Let's just buy Odd Mushroom to start with, actually. And we'll see what, what else we get here. That's... Hmm. On bomb. Get whatever that is. Ooh, shit. On heart, 2% chance to lose one penny. Lose soul heart. First hit, 6% chance to spawn a random boss. Spawn two times small leeches. Um... I think I'm going to take this. Basically because, as I understand it, oh wait, what? It's giving me sty, but it's not actually giving me, oh wait, no, it is giving me damage good. It's just, it's not damage stat. Okay. I thought it was damage stats. Not quite as good as I thought it was going to be. Okay, we didn't get the health I wanted there. Things are looking okay. Lost that damage there. Ooh, okay. I just died. 
yeah, not having a lot of health there didn't really work for us. That was an interesting start, but we got some really bad items there. Like, our item rooms and stuff were just pretty atrocious, so we'll give that another go, shall we? Yeah, they were, they were pretty damn atrocious. Right, um... Best hit each room, 5% chance. Oh, what? Like, let, let's try and reroll to get an actually half-decent starting item. One that at least has an effect that is useful. Like, I don't care about... I don't. It doesn't need to be something crazy overpowered. It just... Could it please have an effect that is actually, like, viable for us to use? Um... Like, even that's not great. I'll, I'll take it, but even that's not great. Um... Each boss kill get... That's pretty good. The losing keys part of that does not sound super good, but otherwise that looks pretty good. Ooh, this guy's got two flies around him. He's going to be an absolute nightmare to kill. Yeah, we actually got him a lot faster than I would have expected. Nice. Stay back, fiend. Yeah, I, I really like that, like, kill streak item we had going on there. That was a lot of fun, but sadly, the health situation was very, very dire. We didn't really get anything to help us out there. These guys are the worst in greed mode, because they leave their webbing, and it's there for the entirety of the rest of the goddamn fight. It ain't going away when you leave the room or anything. Just there now. Oh, what the hell? Okay, at least we get the, the sewing item when we get hit. Nice to have some piercing and be able to join some enemies up and do damage that way. Not a big fan of a lot of you guys. Not a big fan of that. Seems a little annoying. Oh, for God's sake. I'm losing my soul heart so quickly in both of these uh both of these runs thus far and also oh goodness, we're probably dead again here. This is a really rough room. I'm trying to stay away from this goddamn tail, but it's just not plausible. It just moves at such a rate. Okay, okay. Bad start. Can't afford any item, only have half a heart. Try for this, I guess. That gave me some damage up for a little while. That's rather nice. Not a great boss for us to get, but not awful. Oh, God's sake, he jumps quicker than I would have expected. Oh, God. Also, wasn't expecting you for some reason. Oh, my God, our damage. It's so low. This feels like a futile effort. Also, do you have to, do you have to bring more, more enemies into the mix? Did we not have enough already? Was you not enough? I don't want to be dealing with other people. But yeah, as for the question of the day for me, I'm not exactly sure what what that would be for me. I, I think I think it would just be like don't like I, I used to be like kind of afraid and worried about like getting into work, about like being an adult and going getting a job and stuff. Um I'm gonna take this, but it's it's a bit janky. Uh, yeah, I used to be like a, like quite afraid to get into like having to be an adult and go to work and stuff. And I think I've definitely sort of learned now that it's just not a big deal <laughs> and it wasn't that bad at all. Um, and I, I'd love to be able to tell my younger self that. Uh, Rainbow worm. Each regret room, each kill 8% chance to get every kill 9% chance to spawn two Mr. Maws. I don't know what a Mr. Maw is. But I'm, I'm, I'm going to gamble on that. I'm going to gamble on that. And then here we're just going to hope that I don't get hit. My fire rate is so very, very low. But my damage is quite high, so. Okay, there. that's what the Mr. Maws are. That was the only spawn then because there's so many segments for that boss. That it was just a likely chance that, um... Oh, damn. We got 
a lot of these items. I'm guessing I lose them at the, at the end of the floor. I'm not exactly sure. I, I do not lose them at the end of the floor. Okay. Intriguing. Um, seems good. I would very much like a red heart, just to be sure. Thank you. Let's see what we've got going on here. Um, on three kills, 4% chance isn't bad. Um, every 10 rooms. Nah. All of those aren't very good. Is it just you? Yeah, it is. Okay. Weird. God. Probably should have let a skinny odd mushroom stay and taken it. <laughs> Killing stuff is such pain. Oh, Lord. Oh my god, and there's a Mr. Moore there as well. Welcome to the party, pal. Well, there's another Mr. Moore. I have a feeling we're going to be seeing quite a lot of those. These spiders are goddamn useless, not doing anything. Good. Oh shit, you're a red one. Two Mr. Moors again. Okay, th these these things are spawning a lot more often than I would have thought they would. This probably wasn't worth... Oh. Uh. Uh. Okay. <laughs> it's not going well. I did not see that purple fire there. I'm not sure if that spawned in later on in the waves or if that was the, there the whole time. Did not see it coming. Um... Dude, we need we need a starting item that does something. Like just something entertaining at least. Not just literally nothing for the first floor. Every seven rooms see oh, on the every so many rooms. Um every 30 seconds, 40% chance to spawn four. <laughs> that sounds horrific. But I got the pinhead back for this, and I feel like that was worth it. It's just nice to have piercing. A random chance of piercing, I know, but it's still nice. Okay. Okay, when it said random troll bombs, I didn't realize it meant random types of troll bombs. That definitely makes things a little more scary. But, entertaining, I guess. It's, 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 it's added a... A bit of the classic deleted flair to the run, I'd say. Eh. Oh god, I can't kill that little green dude. Luckily my, my, my golden troll bomb did it for me. Oh, I just walked into the goddamn spikes. What's wrong with me today? Clearly something severe. Good. Another one of you guys. Another two of you guys. Yeah, everything's pinned together now. Good, good. Oh, shit. We're stuck in it there. Again, pin everything together. Deal the damage to everything. My golden troll bomb really has been extremely useless this last half of this. It's just kind of tucked itself away in the corner and thought, nah, that's me done. Soul heart there for free. Amazing. Money there. Um Wow, that's not good for the tears down. Not amazing. No oh, really just all kind of naff. Bruh, just wait a bit. 
<laughs> there you go. Each boss kill, uh, chance to spawn eight bombs. First hit each room, get a temporary, whatever that is. Each boss, 3% chance to lose this. I just took the wrong version of it. Just, just end this suffering. Thank you. <laughs> Why am I like this? We're just, just, don't worry guys, we're just building our losing streak. That's what we'll tell people. We're just building our losing streak. It's to build confidence. <clears throat> Oh my goodness. We'll get something started eventually. Instead of dying, get shot speed every 10 rooms, get that on bomb. Something, I guess. It's not great. Right. Wow, that's annoying. That's a load of nothing. Use 25 Ace of Hearts. <laughs> Just our items are just like I, I get the the whole point of deleted is not to reroll until you get something good, but goddamn, our items have been trash. Like really, 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 really trash. There's so so many of them are like each room have this happen. That doesn't work on greed mode, so we can't really go for those ones. It's an interesting take trying this guy in greed mode. It certainly is. I'm determined to make it work. That's fine. We got more damage than we would have otherwise. Um, twenty percent chance for any damage dealt, no more than half heart scales. The reflected to one of the be would be gold. I will open this up. I hope to get something a little bit better than that. But there you go. Pride pin in the machine. Pretty good. Um, hmm, I don't know how that would work, but I'd like to try it. I'm, I'm probably going to try this out, the Charge Baby one. I'm not exactly sure how that would work is the only thing, but I'll find out. we got Jar of Air. On active use, spawn six batteries every nine minutes, use whatever that is. Okay, that's interesting because that would... If, whenever we get an active, we now have infinite charges of it, which sounds certainly pleasant to me. It sounds like something that I would very much like to, uh, to try out. Little hippity hoppities. Oh my god. I've got like a muscle spasm in my arm right now. Can we just get like a random muscle spasm? It's in my arm that I'm using to, to shoot, and it's, it's not helping. It's not helping at all. But yeah, I'm I'm intrigued by this run now because right now it doesn't have anything crazy as it stands. But the 33% chance to get 11 coins when entering a room sounds pretty interesting, depending on how that works. I'm guessing that the, my treasure room and, new, and shop and stuff count as entering a new room, so I'm hoping they count. And then also, the idea of getting an active and it having infinite charges sounds particularly quite good for us if we can get an active that works well for that. I don't know what we'd want. Um, I'm trying to think of actives that would be like really, really good with that setup. Let's just try and live long enough to bring it to fruition, shall we? Because that's not been our strong suit thus far. I'll, I'll keep the big spider clump alive for now. And just try and take out the uh, more annoying enemies first. What we got here? Okay. Take out some of these red boys. I know you're over there doing your split shots and stuff. I'll get to you soon. There you go. Oh shit, you're a you're a regrower. Wasn't expecting that. You're like normally around that colour, so I wasn't sure I didn't realise you were a champion. I like these little tick enemies. They're really good at enemy additions to Isaac. They fit very, very well. And this guy is a champion version of that dude. Okay. We still don't quite have enough for that. Unless... Damn. <laughs> Had to try it. Right. Go, 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 go. 
slightly annoying boss here, but nothing terrible. This is the Monstro that doesn't do big jump, isn't it? Grey Monstro doesn't big jump. It's always hard to remember the champion versions of certain bosses. I've also got two Larrys chilling out. We'll focus on Monstro for now. He's ca I think, I don't know if he's got more health or if we just got low damage, but he seems to have more health than Monstro regularly would. This is unfortunately taking a night and a goddamn day. And also, Larry, you're really not helping the cause here. You're very much in the way. So the reason I'm focusing on Monstro right now is just because he shoots and they don't. And that feels a lot, lot harder to deal with than movement. But apparently, I'm having just as much trouble with these guys as well, so we'll see. Okay, we got one of them. A very, very, very long, arduous process for this boss fight. If they just not kill each other, that'd be so much easier for me. That's one of the worst things about Isaac, is like the early game when you have like low damage or something and you're just sat there firing at a boss with like nothing interesting going on, no cool synergies. It's like, come on. Come on. So we want to be taking this. Potentially interesting. I don't know how good it's actually gonna. There you go, though. That's a bunch more coins there. That's kind of why I wanted it. Right. Quickly go back in here and check if there's not anything else we want to take. Um, first hit. That seems pretty decent. We'll take that. And then we've just got another one of you to deal with, which was not a pleasant experience last time, but it took nothing but time, really. Try and take out this diddy dude here. And honestly, now that we can focus on him entirely, it might just be a bit quicker. But yeah, it says on next floor, spawn 12 times red poops. I think that's going to be a problem because it's going to make this room full of red poops, but also enemies take damage from red poops. So I'm kind of thinking it's an issue for us, but it's just as, just as big of an issue for the enemies we're up against too, right? So it might not actually be as impactful as we as we might have thought in terms of prob as problematic as we might have thought, should I say. Still, our health is low. We've not had any success with buying HP yet or finding things that give us HP. Good. And then we can get the hell out of here. And I'm hoping this 33% chance to give us coins triggers often. There is indeed a bunch of red poops. Luckily, they're nice and spread out. We got a golden binky there, which is honestly something I'm probably just going to buy. Um, can't go in there. And we get the staple here, which I think I'm also just going to take. We have the we have the the prince's crown. Shouldn't shouldn't that be active right now? We have one red heart. Is that not? Oh, that's that that's the dark prince's crown. I'm thinking of what the hell's the red crown then? Is that the trinket? The red crown. Oh, for fuck's sake! I didn't realize there was more of you. We might end up just dying again here because I'll be honest, having one heart right now does not fill me with her. We'll try our best. Okay, yeah, this this. This this whole shebang of having like a ton and a ton of red poops about is pretty good. Unfortunately, enemies that pop up aren't ever gonna get killed by them because uh, they, of course, will not pop up under a red poop. Only things that are gonna walk about are ever, ever gonna walk into them. That hit me. Wow, okay. Didn't expect this guy to get me. Probably still gonna die here. Real excited for when that happens. Things are taking a while to kill, and I have one hit away from death, so... Not not got the, the highest hopes right now for myself, I'll be honest. Especially when I spawn right fucking on an enemy. 
Oh, I'm dead. Yes. Yeah, Dude, okay. So, apparently I picked, like, the hardest feasible challenge possible, which is playing deleted greedier mode. I thought this was going to be, like, an easy breezy episode. We'd get, like, a sick item that would, like, carry us through, and it'd be all sunshine and roses, and the game's just, like, absolutely having none of it. Um, I'm gonna try that out. Okay, we have a little bit of health so far. A little bit of health. Dumpy is... is I, Dumpy's too good not to just take. Sorry, game, but Dumpy is really... Um... Don't know what that is. Not good. Then... Some interesting ones there for sure. Okay, we go again. It's It's been a lot of the first floor. In fact, it's been almost entirely just the first floor this episode. So I do apologize for that, but this is what you get when you go with the deleted sometimes. I didn't really get anything super, super wacky going on, which is a shame. We tried our hardest. We got one more go of it. It's the last, the last attempt I'm gonna go for here. And honestly, I'm gonna say that having, um, Having little Dumpy here certainly fills me with a bit more hope than we've had previously. Should I leave him? He's, he's going to disappear soon, so... No poop for you no more, my good friend. Yeah, I gotta say, fills me with hope. I think we're okay. Do not worry. Do not fret. Oh god. Calm yourself. Oh my lord. This guy's oh my god, this guy with the with the flies around him is an absolute pain in the ass to hit. Wow. Oh, Dumpy just saved me there big time. Thank you, Dumpy. And again. Dumpy is the best the best of all men. And again, three times from the same enemy he saved me. Also, what is it with the game and this champion? Like, can you stop with the champion that has the two flies around it? Also, I have become Hill Gobbler. This room has become very, very scary. And there's still more, apparently, for it. The I'm Drowsy is quite nice, I'll say that. That's helping a great amount. Dude, these enemies with the goddamn flies around them. I can't... Dude. I'm trying my goddamn hardest here to, like, get in there and hit him. And it's... They just keep flying on me, stop! Right, can we, like, do the rest of this room now? Are these extra I'm Drowsies actually doing something? Because they kind of feel like they are. Oh my god, my shots, my, my, my fire rate feels really, really low as well. Okay. We're nearly done. I'm nearly through this tragedy. This enemy, I, I genuinely can't believe it's still alive. Thank goodness it's dead. Give my dumpster back. <laughs> this has been like the longest first floor ever. We have a lot of pills now though. Nice. Bad trip was one of them, lovely. Oh my god. Okay. I 
think we take this. I was hoping I could not take damage there, but that was a foolish herp, I'm, I'm sure everyone knows. Health up. Tears up. Tears up. Tears up. Okay. Okay. Give me all of those. Thank you. Oh, I didn't even... I, I thought that would spawn a bunch more pills for me. It did not. Pop another I'm drowsy. Why not? Okay. Back onto the long boss fights. Unfortunately, we start with pretty low damage here. It's got slightly more fire right now, though, which is nice. I'm going to you two. Hello. Maybe I could just make you go straight into the spikes. That would be helpful. There you go. What about you, good sir? How would you fancy a knight on the spikes? Beautiful. Okay. These guys were just super willing to be very, very uh, cooperative with my demands. Thank you much, Lee. Oh, very kind of you. Oh, also we've got Herming now, which is nice. I forgot that we'd end up using Magician card if we killed a boss. Pretty useful. Is it once once boss is dead? Yeah, Herming for the rest of the room. And later on, more bosses spawn during waves, so that's going to help. Hey, there you go. Right, last one to go. Not that hard a one here, especially because of the spikes in the room. We already saw one of these Larrys just careen into some spikes. Hopefully the rest will follow suit. We just need something that's going to give us a crazy good tier effect. Another I'm Drowsy is probably a good idea. A lot of slowed down music you're going to be hearing here. A lot of slowed down music. Honestly, might take the devil deal here, see what we can get. See if we can get a really good item for clearing or st upping our stats. It's clearing at the minute is very slow. Oh god. He disjointed there, that was weird. Right, we'll check this out. We've got a lot of HP right now. Um, I think we definitely take that. I do think we take this as well. And we'll check what this is if we... Uh, I used an Andraza by accident there. Nah, not worth it. We've got another I'm Drowsy here, haven't we? Indeed we do. Let's pop all these poops. Make sure there isn't some more money to be had. Beautiful. And then, anything else we can do with the shop? I'm... Did I pop my I'm Drowsy again? Ugh. Goddamn game. Luckily, we've got another. Don't worry about it. I will take two of those. And we shall go. Hey, give my hand drowsy. Bit flip on the actual thing I want to be using now. Okay. Thank you, Dumpy, for making me not make mistakes. Or at least making my mistakes better. What we got going on in here? Lots of stuff. Right. Um. Don't want to spawn random monster, thank you. Don't know what the hell that is. I will try that out. Ah, god damn it! There's a creep on the floor there. Get more of my curses. Um... Ooh, that's that's good. Okay, this is really good. We'll definitely take this. Oh, we got brainworm out of this too. Hell yeah. Okay, feeling good. Feeling good. Lemon party. Spider unboxing. Okay. Pretty happy with how all that went down. 
Um, don't think we care so much for that. That seems good. We'll take that. Right, we use, we use a strength card whenever we pop our space bar item, which means it kind of has limited uses. Um, because I think at least it pops a strength card. It said it did. Um, but yeah, like otherwise we'd, our character model would get huge. Brain worm's amazing. Run my cursus now as well. It doesn't look to be popping a strength card though. It says whenever I used it, it popped a strength card, and it definitely doesn't seem to be doing that, so... I'm not sure what lies it was telling me there, but... Hey, her. Those enemies got changed a little bit. But yeah, I think I think we're in a little bit more of a positive situation now. We've got some good items going. We've got Brainworm for the Herming, then we've got actual Herming when we kill a boss. Some decent stuff, we've got okay damage. Which is unusual for us on uh, a greed mode run with this guy. It's not been the, the case most times. Dumpy just doing his thing back here. Honestly, this active is really good. I'm very glad we went Devil Deal this time around. Actually, it's only because we had the, the actual uh, health to afford it this time around. That's another good thing. This this run's actually got HP, which has not been the case recently. So that's a whole new a whole new thing for us. More of my curses is amazing too here. Pick that up off of a random item, and it's showing itself to be very very useful. Balls of steel here, nice. We never popped out our, our, our I'm Drowsy either. I kind of forgot we had that, even though I spent so long talking about it in the last floor. Just never really clocked it. This guy's trying to kill my dumpy for some reason. That's not how that works, my good friend. Um. Oh, I used it again. I'm so stupid. Um. Spawn a bomb grimace. Summon a bar particle. Every two minutes, get what that. Uh, I'm sure I'll take that and see. What's a bomb grimace? Okay, it is what I thought it is. I don't mind spawning bomb grimaces. I'll be honest. It's not a bad thing. And you should not be a problem. Spider I'm liking the balls of steels that they're getting. Definitely the tears up as well. Tears. Oh. And what do you got for us? God damn, really? Just this guy. Nah, I'm okay, thanks. Gotta make sure not to spam bit flip, otherwise we could end up with a situation like this. Really? I've been given the sticky keys notification? <laughs> you troll. I love that. Spawn some cards to start the floor as well. I'm gonna spawn a stars card just so I can uh, go in here. Seems fine to me. Ow. Health up. Health up. I'm drowsy. Health up. Okay. Again, good stuff. We also have stairway now, which, um,. Don't know how that works exactly for us in this situation. But I don't really think it does. Um.
Well, four times shop items. All of these are really great. Yeah, these aren't great. We do have a reroll machine though. Should we can blow up for some other random stuff. Let's see. Nah. Nerve pinch is kind of interesting. I mean, we might just want to take that, although that'd be wait, that'd be minus one damage on top of the damage it already takes away. That's kind of scary. Um hmm. kind of thought that was about to happen. But I have I have feelings about this. This could be really good. Basically, we can reroll pennies, but we can also reroll spawned pills and any other things that we spawn. I think this is very, very positive for us. Why am I picking up the coins then? Stupid. Don't pick up the coins. That's the whole point. We also got a lot of stairways. Don't do anything for us right now, but I guess we have them. <laughs> I guess we just have them. Oh, what the fuck? That hand stole another enemy. Thanks, hand. <laughs> Apparently it being charmed makes it just steal other enemies. I've never seen that happen before. I'm happy for it, but yeah, it's confusing. Also, whatever this fire item we've got is, is doing great work. I'm not sure where we got that from. But it's freezing the hell out of everything. It's the peppermint item. I know what item it's from, but I don't know what item gave us peppermint. I also keep forgetting to use my I'm Drowsies. Sue me, I guess. Okay. Reroll all of that. I mean, these rerolls weren't particularly very good. Wasn't very successful in my eyes. We do have Molten Dime here, which honestly I'd, I think I'd rather have. Molten Dime could be quite fun. A lot of Golden Troll Bombs, I will admit. It's a lot of Golden Troll Bombs. I'm just looking for the Balls of Steel pills. I don't think there is any. Okay. We've created something quite horrific over there. It just kind of is what it is. We've got to deal with it. Our fires are coming back in. We managed to freeze his head. And only his head. There's our homing back. It's the bloat. But it's not a bloat we need to worry about. Because it's the uh, non brimstone bloat. Which is... A weird sentence to say, but it is true. It does exist. Okay. All good. And we got two of you this time. Okay. Don't think you were that hard of a problem before, so I'm not going to worry about you now. One of you is already dead. I have a very long death animation, though. Again, I froze your head. Oh, I really wanted to kill him with his own head there. That'd be funny. Sadly not. Right. Devil deal again. I will most certainly take this. Goodness. Oh, Lord. Which one's the balls of steel pill? I know you're in here somewhere. I can't remember which one Balls of Steel is, so we just have to leave. Okay. Oh, I missed out on that heart. This is... this is strange. 
um, there was a door there for a hot second. Not quite sure what the, what all that was about. Flatstone. Does Flatstone do anything for us in this situation? Don't think so. Don't think I want that. Oh, oh I keep using the wrong things. Take that. I guess I'll check out what's in here. What the hell? I think that's probably pretty good. Yeah, I think this is the one we want. Let's take this. Now we're full on troll bombs again. Balls of steel. Balls of steel's that one. My god, everything's so hectic in there. I can't even look. I can't even look. Buy one item and the whole room turns to shit. It's as if we have like really high luck or something. We're firing at these fires all the damn time. Sadly, as we experienced, the stairways don't even carry over to the next floor, therefore they're entirely useless. But yeah, 3% chance on kill to get two coins is like not terrible either. It's something we managed to get out of that last item. It's not great, it's not terrible. Ah, you can't get past because your buddies are frozen. Get screwed, boy. Get screwed. We are getting a lot more mum's hands because of one of the other items we got. But apparently the mum's hand keeps going after random enemies. Other than us. Apparently it starts charmed. Oh my god. The freezing. The freezing is insane. We looked out with that one. Oh my god. Balls of steel again. Awesome. Shot speed. Two more health ups. Okay. The fire actually does okay damage as well. That's a good thing. It's not just for the freezing. It seems to also do half easy damage. You out pretty damn easy. Oh, walk right into that. Um, we did have a, we did have a, what's it called? Well, that's it. That's what I wanted. Lemon Party really isn't so bad when there's a bunch of enemies like this. Do the I'm drowsy. Oh my god. I could try duping all of these pills, but that seems somewhat pointless. Um, I, I need to read these descriptions quickly. No. Don't care for these. Damn it. Unfortunately, our active hasn't been- hasn't worked once yet. Oh, a secret room. Huzzah. Can't believe they only just uncovered the secret room, I'll be honest. Seems a bit late. Right. Another boss. More shot speed, I guess. Don't know how valuable shot speed is to us, but again, seems to be working out, so I'll just take it. These guys are attached by electricity. That's pretty cool. I've not really seen this version of this champion before, like the half and half version. Is that other mum's hand I was talking about? Next devil deal. At this point, if there's any additional health ups, I'll just have them. This is a bit flip scenario. Um. Fine by me. 
Just let me see the description of the thing. Fine by me. Just get out of here. Just get out of here. Okay. Got a lot of Venuses there. I like that. This has been so stressful. Honestly, so stressful. <gasps> we kept Stairway. We got Sacred Heart and then real Stairway. Okay, Sacred Heart's probably saved this run somewhat. Try and get in there and read this for a second. Not where. Um. Nah. Just go. We got a health up there. All sorts of confusion going on in there. Um. For that. On hit spawn bumbo. I'm gonna hope that's not the boss, but I'm gonna guess it's the boss. I've taken a hefty risk here. Which I'm sure we'll find out the consequences of reasonably soon. Make sure we got Dumpy on us. We got that little charity coin going as well for H HP. We're killing stuff pretty quick. I mean, Sacred Heart was a huge get for us, luckily. Ooh, on boss kill, we use this little head thing. I did get a hit there. I don't see any Bumbo. Maybe that didn't count as a proper hit. I don't know. So many mum's hands. Is also concerning. Ah, that time I definitely got hit. No Bumbo though, okay. I think we got off scot free there. Okay. You're locked in. Don't quite like using this dog head every single time we uh, kill a boss. We can put it away pretty easily. I think we just tap shoot. Yeah, literally if I just tap it puts it away. Okay, nice. My God. Okay. Grab our money and carry on with our lives once again. Increased chance for energy cards to spawn. Ooh, Mother's Love. It's pretty good because it does give us a um, Soul of the Lith on use as well, which I really like. Broke Planet, you kind of screwed me there, didn't you, game? Can't believe Rogue Planet counts as a familiar, but there you go. This room's getting rather, uh, rather terrible. Get the hell out of there. So yeah, now unfortunately aiming isn't so easy for us, um, because we have Rogue Planet, which is something I was not looking forward to having, but we, uh, we do seem to have crazy fire rate right, still, and we still have homing, so still kind of works. I think we'll take this as a just in case. I'm going to take Minos here, and we'll check what the bit flip of this does. Oh, there you go. There he is. Nah, that's not really worth it, is it? Okay, this, this might be a problem. I'm gonna have to get really close to the door so I can actually leave this room. This is bad. I need to leave, but the bumbos keep spawning. I think I've I think I've done it. I think I've just ended my life here. Oh, 
Okay. We are no longer um, the man we used to be. Unfortunately. But we are... Uh... <laughs> we are getting an unlock here, I think. This is not how I intended this to go. I will say that for sure. Not how I intended this to go at all. I'm going to need a lot of HP very, very quickly. Holy hell. That's a lot of cards. Um, death. Lovers. Devil. High Priestess. Hanged Man. Nothing really there I can utilize. Also, had terrible stuff there as well. Great. Ugh. Really hoping for some HP to buy here. And there is none. I was really hoping for some soul hearts there. Okay, health up. Nice. Something. More tears up. The amount of fires I can spawn is, is just crazy. I don't know what's going on with it, but it's, it's crazy. We're all done here. Okay. Right. Let's give this all a go. Not knowing my health right now is scary too. Not a big fan of that. Apparently I've been hit twice already. Again, not so sure as to how. Really need this all to be over so I can just get out of here. Oh my god. <laughs> so confusing. I don't know what to think. The hands really aren't helping because they're just slowing everything down. Last wave. Okay, that's the other hand. And it spawned another hand for fuck. Oh my god. There you go, right. I've got a bit of an idea here. Get out here. Buy this up. Oh, I didn't really think about that, did I? Didn't really think about the fact that it was going to spawn a fucking load of troll bombs. <laughs> kind of useless in there now, isn't it? Right, let's play you for a health up, please. That's not a health up, goddammit. Right, okay, so right now I have a pretty good card on me. It's going to be plus three hearts. I'm going to save this for the boss and use it. And then as soon as I get hit, I try and find myself the closest. I'm drowsy. Oh my god, so many bombs are spawning on me. Stop. I'm getting hit and I don't know by what. So many bombs, what the hell. Still got the card I wanted. Good. I should probably try and do this at least. Oh my god. Okay, we did it. Actually better than what I was expecting. Okay, we've got the lust card. We gots to go. Things have really gone off the rocker here. HP-wise, we're actually not doing as bad as I would have thought. Puzzle piece is good here. Right, let's check our cards here. So, anything that's going to help us out. Yes, perfect. Needed that. Ace of Wands, what does that do? Sends everything to batteries. Unfortunately, it doesn't do much for us. Doubles our number of keys. Hell yes. We'll just take Lust for now.
Good. Oh, we've got golden bombs. That could be potentially useful. We pop Lust, which gives us a three more hearts to play around with. Does unfortunately lower our speed to absolutely abysmal levels. I think it was worth it. Unfortunately, ain't no freezing of this big boy. Minos with BFF looks amazing, by the way. Just, he's absolutely huge. Will say I'm a little disappointed at the lack of damage we're dealing right now. Like, very, very low. Kind of would have thought we'd be wrecking him by now. I'm using bombs, but I'm being very cautious about when I use them. Because um, I do have the... Uh, what's it called? The, the trinket that makes it so that you instantly... Explode bombs, like they explode a lot faster. Yeah. There was a bumbo in the room briefly. Did not approve of his arrival. Oh my god, there's so many hands about to drop on me. Spider unboxing, why not? Help up. Just a soul heart for us, that's great. How is he not dead yet? We're trying. We're trying our hardest. This has been such a journey. Who'd have thought? Who'd have thought we'd actually be making it through this run? I'm liking to get the pennies because they, they actually count as a heart for me. Honestly, Rogue Planet, whatever it's called, has really screwed us. Made it a lot harder to hit things. I wonder if I get full homing after killing first, first wave, that counts as killing a boss. I'm drowsy. There you go, that makes things a lot easier for us. There you go, first phase is done. First phase is done. Second phase, I have no idea how that's going to go. For some reason, I just was not ready for that at all. The Bumbos are dying quick, which is nice. Bad trip. Tears up. Oh, we're getting hit a lot right now. I'm trying to look for any pills that would be potentially useful for me, but... There isn't that many. I'm just getting a ton of shot speed right now, which, again, I don't really know if it's helping much. Place as many bombs down as we can. Oh, and blow myself up with them, why don't I? It's great. No balls of steel pills, though. Not seeing any of those. A lot of, um... A lot of bad trips, though, again. Seems to have an agenda. Seems to know what it's doing. What, what happens if the hand hits you in a boss fight? Does it just remove you from the boss fight? I've never thought about that, actually. I've never been in a situation where it was plausible, but... It might genuinely be the case if I get hit by one of those hands, it'll just... Restart the boss fight. So I'll be very, very cautious about making sure I don't get hit by those. I haven't even ever considered that before. There's just like a constant ring on me telling me to get ready. Okay, we got him. Oh my god. That was a very, very stressful one. We got there in the end. We did it as the wrong character as well, but I'm pretty sure this is still an unlock. Indeed it is. There you go. Perfect. Either way, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one.